This is it, the finale of Minecraft Ninja Warrior, and we all start here on stage two. Our course starts off as the striding steps heading straight into the double salmon ladder. Returning from qualifying is the Piston Plunge. Way back from Season 9 Vegas Stage 2 is the Swing Saver. After that, they have to avoid getting stung by the Hornet's Nest. Then they have to fly through the falling shells with a near impossible blind grab at the end. Starting us off tonight is going to be Sunny 31818. One of the first clears of stage one. Let's see how well he's going to do here. Starting us off now with the striving steps. Here we go. Stops at the end. He's up onto the rope, straight into the double semi ladder. He then makes the transfer. He's going up. So make his way to the bar at the end there. Grabs it. Going across. Now it's the face piston plunge. Here we go. So on the second one. To the third one. And the fourth. See if you can get this one that drops. Oh no, and he can't make it. Last episode you may have wondered where Schmolt the Bolt was from qualifying. When our fastest clears from qualifying had to run stage one early this morning. He was able to do it easily and was only the second in to attempt the high road and he became one of our fastest clears of the night. Now it's his turn to take on stage two. And here he comes, multiple right up to the starting line of stage two. Accidentally flies low, that is not allowed in this competition. He is going to Stage one, he cleared like it was nothing. Let's see if he can do the same thing here on stage two. Off on the feeding steps. I'm sorry, striding steps. Pauses on the third to last one. Pauses again on the last one. Let's go straight to the rope, being extra cautious about it. There he goes, making the jump up to the rope. Let's get through the salmon ladder. There he goes. Makes a transfer to the second one. He just needs to make his way up to the bar to get to the pistons. Here he goes. He got through this obstacle in qualifying. See if he can do the same here. The jumps are a little bit shorter and closer together, but that makes it harder as you have to be more precise with the jumps. There we go. One last more. One more. There he goes. Makes it. Just needs to get the dismount. Nice job. Schmolt. And we're going to get our first look at the Swing Surfer. It's obstacle debuted in Season 9, Stage 2. In this exact same position. Haven't seen it since. So we thought it would be cool to bring it back. He needs to make a way up to the rope. And onto the angled ledge. I was going to be the first one tonight to tackle the hornet's nest so he doesn't get stung by this obstacle like so many did back in Vegas season 14. Let's jump out to the first one. Let's see. Easily makes it to the second one. There we go. Nice transfer from this hornet's nest piece up to the next one. Big throw across. There we go. One last throw. This he'll just need the dismount. There you go, Schmolt. Nice. So you can get these falling shelves. They were so difficult to do back when they first debuted in season 13. 
makes the first grab. So on to shelf number three. Now this is a hard one. This is a difficult one. And there we go, Colt. Nice job. And hits the buzzer. He's our first clear stage two. Let's go. Woo! Excellent job, Colt. Already getting his run started is farmed at 11. In earlier rounds of this competition, he went underneath another name. See how he does here. I believe our third finisher of stage one. Making his way through the double sem letter. So he makes the transfer. Going up to second one now. There we go. Uh, made his way to the bar. On his way to the pistons. So where's training partner that went out? Sunny 31818. See if he has better luck with this obstacle. Alright, this is where his partner. Oh no! What a surprise. I thought for sure he was getting through that. But anyways, next up, we have Ninja Oh Your Bro, our fastest clear of stage one. First person to actually attempt the high road and get it. Already starting off. Taking a little bit of a slower approach, very uncharacteristic of him, as we are used to him going fast, as he had the top times for semifinals, qualifying, and stage one. I think he just wants to try out stage two since he knows he can get it. Very excited to see that course later today. Making his way to the Pistons. Already on the fourth one. Makes the very difficult fifth transfer. Oh, and there we go. Straight into it. What we like to see from Ninja. Oh, your bro. Speed is the name of his game. Man, this guy's new. Already on Hornet's Nest. Makes a transfer out to the second, which is up to the third. Big throw across to the fourth. On to the fifth. Nice job. Just get the dismount now. There we go. Falling shelves. He's going through this fast. We're gonna get two clears, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my gosh, and he's done it. Ninja oh your bro shocking us once again with his impeccable run. Oh my goodness. We'll see Schmolt the Bull and Ninja oh your bro on stage three. Now let's take a closer look at stage three. And starting us off for stage three will be Schmolt the Bolt, the second fastest time of stage two. Already getting hyped up as the first obstacle he will face is Patriot Pass. Jumps up to the first one. Chain. I meant to say chain. Chain number two. And chain number three. Get to that dismount. Nice. Obstacle number two. Once again, going with his traditional cautious approach. Efficient. However, he does want to go slower than some of the other competitors may as he wants to make sure he can get through the course and not make any mistakes. Next obstacle, chop it up. Let's take up Max Feinberg on NW14. 
I unfortunately slip up there as you do slam your face into a couple of logs, but that's fine. There you go. Quickly guess to that dismount. Alright. First one, try the ultimate cliffhanger. Really excited how he's going to do on this one. Looking for a place to hold this. Oh man, what? An early shocking fall from Schmolt the Bolt. And dropping in on us now is Ninja. Oh, your bro. The fastest time of stage two. Really excited to see his run here. He hops up onto the block. Already going for it. Making his way to the second chain. Now going to the third chain. Just needs to get the dismount. Already way above pace for Schmultable. If he can just get to the ultimate cliffhanger faster than him, he will win. Unfortunately, as of right now, you do have to climb the stage 4 tower to win that $100 grand prize. All he wants to do is make it there. Have a shot at that grand prize. That's the first... Transfer on chop it up easy. Now just has to make the last one. Oh my goodness, he was right there. He actually touched the platform. Thank you guys for watching. This was actually really fun for me to make. I know I wasn't great about getting them uploaded on time, but next season I will have more of a set schedule for you guys. So that's great.